Right, after five minutes with my super efficient war chiller, we're down to... Thirty-six degrees C. Ah, it's a little on the high side. We were colder than that a second ago. What thirty-six? I'm going to be adding cold water to this anyway because we're short of uh, five gallons. It's boiled down somewhat. There's our hot bag. Give him a little squeeze. Right. Those beautiful hops have done their job. Here we've got the fermenting bucket. Let's get this water in. Now we want to put as much air into this as we can. So. It's a high, slow pour. Beautiful. So next we will want to top up to the 20 litre mark. There we go. Right, so that's 20 litres of beautiful, beautiful wort. So, quick stir. Temperature reading 28, 26. A little on the high side, but we can pitch at 26, that's fine. Let's have a look what we've got. Don't know if you can see this. I can. Wow. Wow. 1052. Let's have a look what we're aiming for. We've got this uh, recipe here. We're looking for 1054. I've got 1052. That's not bad. Not bad at all. And they want us to finish at 1008. So it should be a good brew. Well, I'm happy with that. That's fine. So we'll get some yeast in. So here I've got a packet of Safe Ale US05 yeast. Now I'm going to use all but the last three or four grams of this because this is the last three or four grams is going to go into this batch. So we'll just take the top off. And I'm going to put my finger, I'm going to grab some. And I'm going to sprinkle the rest in. What we got left? Probably 
Runs it left. There we are. So there's just a little bit left in the, uh, you see that, in the packet. That'll do this little extra gallon of beer that I've got on the side. Anyway, lid on. And there we go. My first all grain is in the bag. Let's see how this turns out. Okay, last instalment of the experiment after the first all grain brew. This is what we've got. That was, I was just gonna throw the grains away, but I decided to run four liters of boiling water through them, and we got this. So I boiled it down, added a bit of water, and we're just gonna do an hydro read and see what we've got. This is sterilized. Okay, pop that there. I can already see we're quite high. This had been cooled with the wart chiller down to uh, 22, 23. So we should be fine to pitch the yeast and take a reading. And it's at 10.42. So that's as strong as what you get from a extract kit. 10.42. So that should give me, if I ferment it right out, a beer of around 4.7%. And it was going to go, and I was going to throw it. I've got an extra 8 pints from it. Wow. So yep. Yeah. We'll pop that back in. Pop in the little bit of uh, Safe Ale USL5 yeast that we saved from the larger batch that we did earlier this evening. Just slide him in there. Maybe just a bit less than a teaspoon, but I'm sure, sure it will get it going. And if I pop down here, get ourselves a little airlock, bit of sanitizer on there, and we'll just put a bit of water in. Right, we'll leave that to go. So hopefully, we've got five gallons of my very first all grain brew, and we've got a gallon of what you'd call second sparge, I suppose. I don't know, there's probably a proper term for it. We'll have to have a look online. Um, but yeah, there we go, guys, gotta try it. Gotta have a go.